an island islander. And of course, that may be the new theme song. I don't know for Demare, but y'all know oh, what time. Is. Hey, there's oh, Demare. No. Y'all know what time it is, right? Yeah, uh, I know what time, time it is. Mr. Edward Contreras of Up and Smoke Management Corporation, exclusive manager of that guy, and we approve this message. Hey man, did you see that guy? What guy? You know that guy. No, what guy? Ah. And now, it is time for that man, the legend, that guy, Christopher Ferrara. Yeah! yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Listen, we were only 30 seconds late. Let me tell you something. Did you see me? Did I know, you see? I, know, I was pointing I to my wife. I've, uh, I've already got a I, telegram from your management department. Okay, I got it. I got it. I, I was about to send a, a, a urgent message right up to Up and Smoke Management via smoke signals. I will tell you that right now. But I've already <laughs> reminded your management company that you were on earlier in the show, so you know you got a lot thirty seconds or so in there, you know. So you know, <laughs> you're on twice today. You know, it's all good, man. <laughs> hey, hi everybody. Good morning. Good afternoon. Hi, how's everyone doing? Hey, Wonderful. Doing very good. We're doing great, man. It, it, good we, to see you. If we was any better, it'd be a, a crime, and then they'd come get us and haul us away. <laughs> hey, listen, you know, you had mentioned that I was on twice. You know, a, a big apology to Michelle Myers. Um, Danny, I thought you were just going to keep me in the green room, and I was just going to make sh- make fun of Michelle while she was on. I didn't know I was going to get on, and you're damn lucky I had clothes on. <laughs> <laughs> no, really, you're lucky you had clothes on. <laughs> yeah, right, no, no, everybody else is lucky. Listen, I, I have to deal with myself every day, so you are all lucky. I, yeah, we don't want to see that. I'm just the guy flying the plane, okay? And if you fall out, that's your business because I'm I'm doing this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm hanging on for dear life right now, I gotta tell you. You know, one thing I could tell you so far with this show is um I'm definitely have to speak to my manager, Mr. Edward Contreras of Up and Smoke Management. I definitely need a wardrobe room. So lots of changes going on. Well you'll you have know? to take that up with him, okay? <laughs> I will well he's got me I got blue tutus, I got pink shirts, I got radio Sticky Man radio shirts, I, I got my hats, beach Buddha cups, Sticky Man cups, Conkfish Nation cups. Key West Finest Cups, so I'm all out there. You know what I mean? I got this stuff. weird. I'm like a walking billboard. I got this weird envelope in the mail the other day, and it was FedEx, right? So you got to open up the 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 envelope, and then you go in, and there's another envelope in it, and you got to open it up, and then there was a letter that <laughs> that said, you know, up in smoke management, and it just simply was a real sen- one sentence, and it was typed, "How much room is in the gift shop?" <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I don't know if we got tutus. We got room for tutus in there. <laughs> you know, Danny, with these packages, what is it with everyone with the tape? I know, right? I remember that when you, you guys sent me the uh, the flag, right? I was like, holy crap. I had to get the blowtorch out and get and melt the edges off the tape. I'm like, it was going to be safe. You made sure it was safe, for God's sake. I love how Kat said, you taped the package. You taped the package. <laughs> She's so funny. There was like a whole roll of tape. There was a whole roll of tape on that just to drive you nuts. Right? No, she taped the bag. She taped she the bag. I taped the package, she says. Yes. Yeah. yeah. That was Frankly. just cat. Just cat upstairs. Just cat. Right? Just cat. Just Good cat. morning, sweetheart. Just cat. Yes. So, all right. Just shoot. Let's see here. Let's get to work here a little bit. Get uh we got a pretty good list of uh, new members of the Cockfish Nation, right? Oh, oh yeah, I got some real tongue twisters today, boy. Yeah, I I had a prep for this one big time. All right, here we go. Let's see here. All right, each and every week we do the new members of the Conkfish Nation powered by Key West Finest. Well, who is Key West Finest? Well, that's your hookup for everything on and off the Wall Street. You can reach out to Ask Key West Finest Concierge Explanation Point. And that is Jackie. She will hook you up with everything on and off the Wall Street. All right, brother, take it away. Here we go, newest Conkfish members. Debbie Lee, Arkeeb Yeager Ryan, Vanessa Johnson, Denise Stembridge, Carol Angst Beard Windham, Kelly Eckert Honing, Marcy O'Mara Menz, Jerry Blankenship Stockbloom, <laughs> Josh Dixon, Baze Smith, Thomas E. Latimer Jr., Rachel Barber, Nancy Riggleman, Greg 
Nautska. What? Wait a minute. I, and what, Karen D. No, what, what was Greg's name again? Yeah, what was Greg's name? I missed that. Um, Greg Naus Nauska. N a w s t k a. Nauska. I remember when y'all used to make fun know. of the hippie chick trying to do these uh, these things. I'm like, oh yeah, watch this. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I, I'm very comfortable announcing these names because if I get them wrong. Whatever. Yep, whatever. You know, <laughs> whatever. What am I? Listen, you know why? Because I wanted to just do the first and last name. You know what? Let me let me give everyone their props on this. Welcome to the Confish mm -hmm. Nation, everybody. You got a yeah. plane going ahead. Yay! Yay. Yeah, welcome. Welcome to <laughs> welcome the best club to be everybody. A um, you know, your first duty as a Confish, of course, is make sure you subscribe to Tiki Man Radio on YouTube. Um, yes. And make sure that you um, support Key West Finest Confish Nation. Become friends with everybody. Um, help us help you. Uh, you know we're growing tremendously. So please help us. Make friends, okay? Participate, be involved with everybody. It's what I really ask as the mayor. That's my most important thing. And I'm going to tell you all why, because as you see right here and now, all my friends, my dearest friends, mm -hmm. I met right through Confish Nation, Key West Finest, Tiki Man Radio. So let's just keep that going. Um, you know, let's be active, okay? There you go. And That's uh, your thing. and don't forget to subscribe to uh, B Man and Michelle's uh, YouTube channel. We got to get those guys up to a uh, thousand subscribers as well by the time we roll back into uh, Key West at the, in November for the Tiki Man Radio Sunrider Showcase Key West Bound, which will also be the reunion week. I understand. Uh, so it's gonna be a big, yeah, big, absolutely. big week. Uh, there'll be about fifty conch fish nation in town, from what I understand. Yeah, we're coming in strong. Um, Amber and the team is just getting the logistics together. It's a little early yet. We have a, we have all the ideas, mm -hmm. but to put everything together, the dates, the times, who's going where, what boats. We have a lot of boats coming up. Also to incorporate your show. Um, also to incorporate when I'm going to be on your show and I can't make a conch function. So... You know, there's a lot going on there. Well, yeah, yeah. I mean, you know, we'll we'll save a seat for you. And the good news is we will have plenty of room, plenty of microphones, plenty of cameras, you know. to ca We'll have all four cameras spotted lighted on you and your blue tutu. <laughs> oh, jeez. Yes, that's correct. You know, I, I really knew that I'd have a seat, even if I had to kick Jason out or something like that. I know I'd have a seat of spotlight and a microphone. <laughs> Jason doesn't go on the road. He won't go on the road and do radio, you know, so. You, you know what? Know. As, funny as, I'm, as funny as I might look in the things I wear, just when you said to see him in a black hat singing Kiss, oh that's God. like a bad trip. I don't know about that. Well, that's one. why. Oh, yeah, there's pictures. Know. Oh, yeah. There is we pictures. We have pictures. <laughs> there is pictures. Well, I'll tell you what. You're going to have to sing Kiss while I'm up with my um, hot mesh shirt and my blue. <laughs> 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 that there you would go. be the best picture yet. There yes. you go. In the in the Corvette driving through Chattanooga. Oh my God! Okay. I yeah. love it. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. People people will follow y'all <laughs> here just to see what the hell's going on. Yeah. Yeah. What is that? Yeah. You know, <laughs> that's different. Don't you know, see that. Danny, no. What's that, brother? Dan Danny, you know you had uh, picked me up when I was in the green room. I, you know, I apologize to Michelle Maya. Is it? I did not mean to steal it. Her thunder. Her I know. What was that uh, all about? Oh, we were teasing you. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> we're just messing with you, man. You, oh, I know that, but you know I love to hog the spotlight. So you know, I kind of love it anyway. <laughs> you? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> hey, hey, you know what? I'm glad you mentioned um, Mark. Yes. Um, Mark um, with the construction. Keys, custom construction and remodeling. I, I absolutely am going to call him this week because yes. I need a contractor to do some more work at CK's, and I'd much rather use someone that we know, a friend of ours, a friend of yours, come to my house. I, you know you know, you get the right deal when it's more of a friend basis than a perfect stranger. So I'll be calling you, Mark. Thank you so much. Yes, and uh, I gave you the phone number earlier, and I'll mention it uh, a little bit later as well. But, I mean, that's kind of the thing, and you can kind of help me with this. I mean, it's – uh, first of all, uh, and you know this because we know you were in the mob up in New Jersey, but well, we're not yeah. going to say anything. But <laughs> getting getting permits, getting permits in uh, Monroe County is not easy. So you got to have somebody that knows how to do that, and somebody that you can trust. And there's a lot of snowbirds that have a uh, property in Key West 
that are only down there about three or four months. And every time they go back, they're like, yeah, we really need to get this fixed. Or I'd like to do something with this kitchen or this, that, and the other. Now we have somebody yeah. that we can talk to, we know personally. And, I, and again, I would never get on the radio and endorse anybody that I don't know and trust. Yeah, you know, you hit the nail on the head about the permits. Yeah. I, I'm all for permits. I got no problem with that. I got no problem paying you. Just move along with it. Yeah. It, it takes a permit to get a permit for a permit here. Yeah. You, you know, crazy. you have to spend a couple of hundred to spend a couple of hundred to ultimately get to that thousand. Why don't you just charge me a thousand dollars one time and give me the permit? Yeah. So you do need to know somebody. There's a lot involved with the county. You know, it, it's just a. It's a pain. It's not okay? like you could so just you know, deliver you concrete, deliver concrete to the chief's house, uh, you know, up in Jersey or something. You know, it's right. not like that. You know, <laughs> don't talk about concrete. All right? <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say no. Now I'll tell you something funny. I have to give you. We were watching. Uh, I was, concrete shoes. I was watching this uh, video the other day. I got very intrigued about this art that was stolen. It was stolen art from the something place over in Boston. Yeah, and it's never and been it, found. No, and it was very priceless, like the Sea of Galilee. Um, yeah. You know, they've never found it. Never, never found it. It was still a heist missing. that is still missing. Yeah, it, st- it uh, was stolen in 1990, which they make it sound like it was in the 1940s, 1990. But like it was, it was a long time ago. But, yeah. you know, it's been a long time ago, and uh, so they've never found this art. So anyway, you know, the second part of this uh, whole series, it goes into, well, the, the mob used to use priceless art as a get-out-of-jail-free card is, oh, yeah. is, what, is, is the, what they're saying in the story. And one of the lo, guys... Lo and behold, one of the guys' name was Ferrara, Ferrara. <laughs> that, that they had in the segment. And I said, I told you he was in the mob. I told you. I'm like, hit me, Jack, come look at this. <laughs> I said, I told you. <laughs> Listen, the documentary is... We make up stories It's already out there. It's yeah. A, yeah. But oh, it's yeah. true. You need to go look at that. You may be related to some of these people. Yeah. You know, I have to tell you, in 1985... <laughs> <laughs> now be careful you're in the witness protection program we can't well, say yeah. anything you know <laughs> yeah I, I am actually going to tiptoe around this but in 1985 mm-hmm. somebody got whacked in manhattan and i didn't know if i had to go to work that day oh. because it ah. be yeah yeah, yeah. It happened to be someone very close to me, so I'm like, oops. <laughs> that's all I, I think it's time to retire and go to Key West. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know, that's yeah. how Captain Tony got there. <laughs> so. You know, you know, I'm pretty soon I'll be running for the real mayor, just like Captain Tony, all right? Oh, there you go. Oh, hey, wow. that's awesome. Yeah, I'm rolling right along. I'm rolling right along. And, You're definitely and, rolling. Uh, There's no doubt about that. Well, you fit right in. There's no doubt. So. See, I knew he had to chime in with something. <laughs> <laughs> I, I haven't been rolling because I've been u- using this awesome pipe. So there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I don't have to roll but, no more. Yeah. yeah. Well, there you go. But listen, how many vegetables is Heather planting? Yeah, but do you? I'm planting a whole oh supermarket. God. Listen, it's out of hand. It's out. No, of it's hand. not out of hand. It's just getting started. You know, I can't wait till they first pop up and I just get to say hello. So she friends. bought nine thousand dollars in seeds. Okay, and <laughs> not uh, quite, and but then, over two hundred. And then you read the little packet and it says only use one. <laughs> yeah, and I'm like, wait a minute. You mean I? Yeah. Just take you know one what, tiny she, little seed. She can use the dirt from the worms to fertilize that. That's yeah. it. That's what the worms are for. Oh, that's yeah. exactly what the worms are for. They don't know for. it yet, but uh, that's what's going to happen to them. <laughs> yeah. You know, I'm really not sure I want to come up to that house because I don't know what I'll be eating up uh, there. Well, <laughs> it's gotten crazy because now the worms, this new, these new batch of worms, they must be from a different country or whatever because now you open the lid and they're, and they're like having a party. Hey, man, shut the lid down. You're letting the light in. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> we don't need no stinking vegetables. We don't need no stinking come vegetables. On. We're making tea. We're working here. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. The president's good. I got an airline going over me. Oh. Oh. I can't hear you. Anyway. 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 Where was I? I lost myself now. <laughs> There's no way you could. Myself. There's no way you could lose. We were yourself. talking about worms and vegetables, and then we were done. Yeah, yeah worms and vegetables. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know where I was going with that. I need another hit. Okay, fine. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. I, I want to know why Jason always has to pick on me. You know what? I have to pick on Jason? Yeah, because well, I like you. We know that's why. We know how sensitive you are. You know. You know it's a big day Tuesday here, right? What's Tuesday? I know it's four twenty. 
Oh, yeah. Well, well, it's Taco Tuesday and 420, so when you get the munchies, you got the taco. <laughs> well, yeah. Yeah. That's fantastic. Okay. What a great day. It's your so, day. Yeah. Well, make sure. I am. I'm prepared. <laughs> I'm prepared. Well, make sure that uh, you reach out to Mark because, you know, King David, you're working him to death every time he comes down there, you know. You know, he went home. He needed a vacation from my house. <laughs> I know he did. I know he did. Yeah. People are like, when are you going back to Key West? He's like, not for another six months. I'll tell yeah, you that. Yeah, forget that. You know what? You know what, Danny? You're all wrong because we're actually already planning. Uh, when he comes down October, November, I already have jobs for him. <laughs> <laughs> well, all right. Well, maybe I'll reach out uh, to him and because... tell him to call Mark. <laughs> but, you know, let me, let me also say, um, you know, David has um, um, the room. And actually, David is stepping up a lot because somebody very close to me is getting knocked down some notches. I can't say who, but Uh-oh. someone Ooh. who stays here a lot. Um, you know, he happens oh. to be my manager. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I know who you're talking about. Yeah, because... Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That was the first thing he told us That's when we got right. in the car. You know Ed's not allowed over here anymore, right? I'm like, what? <laughs> what? What happened? <laughs> so I have these little voodoo dolls in the room. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna start that. I'm gonna start to hang him up and stuff, and you know, throw dots at them and stuff, and like, just to see if he ever wants to cancel another trip at CK's. <laughs> yeah, there you go. You know? Yeah, because you know so, that, that's not cool. It is what it's it not is. Cool, you know. It's not. Yeah. It's not. I gotta tell you. Hey, you know, um, guys, you know, to touch base on Key West a little bit. Yes. Yeah. yeah. We are jammed. Yeah. 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 Okay. Key West is absolutely um, happening. It's busy. Um, out on the water, Duval Street, fishing, everything, everything is happening like a year ago. Yeah. Uh, I'm real yeah. happy to say the only, we're back, we're back strong. The only difference yeah. is uh, getting people to work. You know, the Key West needs people to work right now. So if you need a job, uh, that's another good place you can go. If you want to get yeah, off your know, ass and go to work, uh, you know. But it's not just work. It's housing. Yes. Yeah. We, we have a serious housing shortage for the workers wow okay um, you know i believe there's over three thousand uh sh- three thousand short of places for workers to stay wow so you might get it you might get a job but yeah good luck finding a- affordable house to stay well i was going to say it's they, probably they, affordable housing because they jacked up the rent so much because of last year yeah 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 everything is correct that's, um that's not going to work unfortunately it's not going to work it's not going to work it's not going to work it, it might bite them in the ass for that yeah. you know um the price is going up prices is going up salaries are not going up the rent is going up salaries are not going up so it's really really hard yeah that's that's um, not going to work that, that's a that's a recipe for disaster for an economy that needs to be rolling you know, so that's absolutely, I Danny. I could tell you if I was mayor, I'd be straightening that out right now. Okay? Well, why don't you take some okay. care of that? You know, uh, you know what? I might start this campaign up. I will tell you, I might start. <laughs> well, you got your own radio <laughs> station. You we'll do. Help you. Yeah. yeah. I know I do. I know what? I, I actually want a, a bigger screen so you can get all of me in, all right? <laughs> oh, no. I don't know if we talk, want all that. Oh. I'll talk to my manager about that. Well, because, you know, you can't see what's, you know, what else I'm wearing. Well, there, you, oh, we yeah. well, you, there, know there you go. There you go. There you go. You got a bigger screen now. Can you see it? No. No? No. You can't? No. Okay. I can. Yeah. yeah. Well, I, I can. I'm in the green room. I still see me right here. Scott the Chill, a, a shout out to the Chill. Hey, the Chill man, the Chill Master, the Chill Danny, Master. Danny, I had sent you a text the other day yeah. saying that it was a, a, a awesome acquisition on Tiki Man Radio's part. Um, you know, I listened to him on that guest DJ spot for that hour, yeah. mm-hmm. and I really enjoyed the show. I I, I really enjoyed his music, him talking. Um, he's got a real calming voice totally hello. opposite of me hello everybody so, hey there yeah yeah you know what when, and then i listened to him just put um, me in your glass and on his glass show cool. and, and you know he's telling you so go mix another cocktail and you know i felt like rolling one right there <laughs> and just sitting back and really listen to him yeah well because he makes you nice he gets you into that chill mode so i'm i'm wishing uh scott dyer who is a conch by the way, okay? Yeah, I'm right. wishing Scott Dyer the best of luck with Tiki Man Radio. Um, well, I, you know, I enjoy it. I enjoy listening to him. So. Well, Alan, I, you know, you should go by... Hey, hey, yeah. Oh, there you are. We, you should go by Alan oh, uh, Moltz Gallery and uh, tell him you heard about his gallery on Tiki Man Radio. 
And uh, hopefully we'll get Ruth yep. the Truth Dyer on there with him uh, in the next coming weeks or so so we can uh, hear her lovely voice. Oh, yeah, she's awesome, too. You know, she was in yeah. my house. I seen her looking around my house like she wanted to refurbish it, you know, because she does that. That's what um, she does, yeah. It's the design and stuff. I'm like, what are you looking at? Don't be spending any more of my money. <laughs> <laughs> you got to get know, the they, hell they out they of really here. Did yeah. send me, they did send me a beautiful picture, yeah. um, um, which I will post. Um, it's on my wall right now. So I'll send out a beautiful uh, hand-painted picture that I, from Scott and Ruth Dyer. There you so go. A big shout-out to them. And you know what? All the Confish Nation, we are we are doing great. We're getting bigger and bigger. Um, you guys know that. We're, we're so strong right now. Being uh, for Brian, with your 1,000, you know, I said it last week, Brian, um, and then I went to see you this week at the, um, at the tasting room, mm -hmm. and I forgot to uh, mention that about <laughs> getting more people. Yeah, we got I got a lot on my mind, so I, I'm sorry, um, Brian, Brian Fields. I'll get it out there. I'll get the Confish Nation, get you up to 1,000 real quick. All right, there you buddy? go. There you go. We need to do that. And, of course, uh, we carry the Tuesday on the Island replays right after uh, Sunday mornings with a Tiki Man now, uh, which comes up about, you know, 110, somewhere around in there, 110, 115 or whatever. So uh, if you miss it throughout the week, you can get to hear it on Tiki Man Radio. There you go. Yeah, awesome. Yeah. I want to I wanna, I wanna, um, say one more thing. Um, it's a little – it's a little bit different than what we're talking about. It's something I thought about all week, and I'd like to. Danny, Heather, mm -hmm. um, has has everybody been doing their water? Has everybody been eating right? Yes. Oh, yes. Yeah, very much so. I, 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 I told you this before. I'm having a hard time getting back into the groove. Well, yeah, the, 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 change, the change in the uh, temperature, the weather, and all that stuff definitely changes it. I mean, I'm maintaining uh i weighed myself this morning so i'm i'm about 49 pounds i fluctuate between 53 and 49 pounds but i i weighed myself this morning uh but it's it's uh the you know i feel really good that i've been able to maintain where i where i hit that wall or whatever now i know that uh, you know if i want to get another 10 pounds or whatever then i'm gonna have to change some other things but uh you know i'm pretty happy with you know 49 pounds i'm you know i'm happy with 53 <laughs> It is awesome, Danny, and, and you know, I'm very proud of you. I remember as the weight loss, I remember when you hit that wall. I've been feeling sluggish, and uh, I'm, I'm attributing that to some poor eating and not enough water. Yeah. yeah. Um, when you're not enough water, you know, you have those bit of dehydration. Yeah. Where you, you, you know, you just get these little things that start bothering you, like the shakes and stuff like that. Um, so please, everybody, as it gets hotter, especially if you're down in Key West, all right? Don't yeah, get drink hydrate, water. Get your electrolytes in. I, I just wanted to say that because I haven't been my sharpest. I am still exercising. You guys know that. Yeah, I we am see still it. doing everything I should be. But the more and more people come in here and the more and more people I go out with, is more and more delicious meals I'm having. Yeah. And, you know, desserts and ice cream and you know oh yeah and i'm not feeling my best when i eat dirty yeah right so you know maybe we might have to start a little challenge again in a couple of weeks i think that's a good idea some, we can do that yeah just to get us in some summer shape you know, so that might be the work you know if you see chris bellamy chris bellamy hasn't slacked off at all no he is um, doing if fabulous anything, yeah if anything he's cinching up a little better so a big shout out to chris bellamy he's still losing he's up in his game he's uh changing his workout if yeah. you notice um, you know, instead of walking this, he, he's just changing, which is good. You're shocking your system. Yeah. Your system gets used to something and it gets real comfortable. So, you know, you don't want to be in the comfortable zone. Right. So these are things that um, I'd like to talk to you about, Danny, in the sure. coming weeks. So that maybe, you know, in, in May sometime or next year, I don't know, let's get back in the game. And, you know, even if we don't shed weight, eating healthy, drinking water, you know, we'll get glowing complexion and stuff like That's that. That's right. Feeling good, all right? Well, I feel like yeah, I'm going to so have a I, hell of a lot of vegetables in my very near future. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and yeah. worms. Yeah, <laughs> and vegetables worms. Vegetables and worms. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> all right, brother. Uh, we, I feel so bad. We're going to let you fly, man. Um, always a pleasure, guys. Thank yeah. you so much. Um, B-Dog Jason. Um, B-Dog, I'm sorry you have to sit next to him, but it is what it is. <laughs> yeah. um, it is I'm what it is. I'm used to it now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> You know. All right, brother. Hey, listen, 
I, I'm working on coming up there also, okay? That's awesome. So, okay. I want to see you, man. Ju- July the 11th cool. is uh, coming fast, so, you know. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you, Teaching Man Radio, Key West Finest Conference Nation. See you next week. All right? See you, man. Right. See, see ya. Bye, guys. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye.